What's up, fierce young? I'm Tash Rose, and welcome back to the channel. If you're new, hit that subscribe button and join the gang. So, this vlog is going to be a weekend vlog. Why? Well, today's already Friday. What happened was, I recorded a weekly vlog last week, but I'm completely just trashing it. Like, after editing it, I just said, No, I don't like this. But if this vlog is short or I could use more extension, I might add it. So that's that. It was supposed to post this week. It was supposed to post this week. And this week, I did not vlog at all. I deactivated my Instagram and completely ghosted everyone. I didn't go to the gym. I didn't do nothing. So I had nothing to vlog this week. And guys, 10 out of 10 recommend it. It's such a good feeling. Like, I'm just home watching. Um, What's that cartoon that I'm, I've been watching again? It's like Big Mouth, but it's like a re a rerun, did I call it? No. What do call it again? Human Resources. Yes, I've been watching that and I'm just watching other movies because I haven't watched or used Netflix in months. Like, I just be paying for it for no reason and I wasn't even using it. So it was just so nice to take a break from like the internet and the outside world for a bit. Even though I had to rush on Instagram like three days after my deactivating because I had promo that I completely forgot about. But mm, it's whatever. I didn't want to delete the app because I don't want people to message me and feel like some may ignore them. So I deactivated it so that them can't message me. You know? <laughs> this vlog was supposed to start from this morning. For some reason, I always feel like I can do something in 15 minutes or I can do something in 30 minutes when in reality, it will take the whole day. So I had to install this wig and I installed the other wig. And literally, I'm going to have to take this wig off tomorrow to install another wig. But yeah, that's the item here or there. I literally planned out my whole weekend. So I could give y'all a good vlog but it went trash but guess what it's not too late to like pick it up back and get on track so I'll be recording for the weekend I was supposed to do so much today anyway so I ordered some stuff from Shein it was like I was putting this in the end of last week's vlog but the camera the camera died for a freaking reason a reason because my camera knew I was going to throw that vlog away so I'm gonna put it in this vlog even though I already opened some of the stuff for some reason I really like to show what I buy like even if my mom is here and I'm like hey this is what I buy hey look at this look at that look at it like at least I love to show what I buy I don't know and I want to see if we have the same taste we like the same stuff we share the same interest so I bought some stuff and I'm going to do the unboxing right now for me Shopping is therapeutic. Like not gonna really excite me no more. Except for like shopping and y'all, of course. So whenever I feel down or sad, I won't say depressed because depressed is a strong word and I don't think I've ever been in that state. So let's just say down. I like to shop even though in the long run. Mega feel away because you know like skin. But it is something to look forward to and I love that like my days are always repetitive repetitive. Oh, um, about this. It's not from Shein. It's a light that can light up it can light up to the front and it can light up to the back But why am I showing you all this is it's for $1,200 One of the things that I used to do when I just started like my online business I used to buy things for that is like wow That's so cheap and then I sell it back. So if you are having problem with like you know trying to make some extra money or so first you can do that find your local Chinese Chinaman store or you know anywhere you know sell some nice things for like really cheap price and you can at least make a 500 profit on it girl do it do it you literally don't even have to buy this stuff you can like go there see what is what you like or what you think that people be interested in and get pictures or something and post it and then they can find out how much you be interested in it and then when they're ready to buy it you go there and go buy it and sell it back period also the fuck it's there also so i used to do that like you're not killing nobody you're not crying that's what business is also you buy something cheap and you sell it back so yeah i bought this mirror and i really like it anyways child let's get into this unboxing so i'm gonna show y'all the gadgets that i've bought first i've already opened 
worth it. This is my first time buying like gadgets on Shein. So this is, oh, let me show one in the box. Something. But yeah, I bought this. It's a garlic crusher, but I've used it with my cheese. <laughs> so you basically put the garlic in this and then you... I've used it already, so it works well. And yes, I did thoroughly clean it. And I bought this. So it's like a juice mixer. You can with your egg, your coffee, your smoothie, or whatever. Um, I haven't tried it yet, but obviously it works. I had to buy a battery for it. If there's anything that you like or want in this haul, you can just comment it down below and I'll just leave the link. You know, it's not sponsored, but I got you if you want it, you know? Okay, and this, I haven't opened this as yet. So it's this. It's a sewing machine, but it's like an and L. Yeah, it's an and L sewing machine. And if y'all don't know, you probably don't know me like that. I used to sew, like I do own a sewing machine. I used to do fashion designing. Or I tried. Not say I tried, like I can do it, but the machine was my mom's and my mom gave me it and the machine wanted to fix. I paid a hell of money to fix the machine and then the machine still start drop stitch and give problem and I just did develop it out. And them time them never have money for buy a new machine just like that. So we just leave it. But I can sew, I like sewing and I like you know we can't even sew with my and like hello. I've built so many clothes and I've been making clothes since high school. Girl talented bad man I lie. But anyways, portable and cardless. It, it, them say I can use denim, silk, crafts, drapes. Well, man, let's make a test it out right now. I did buy some battery, and people say I ate a battery using it. So let me get closer to unbox some guys. Oh my god, I'm so pretty. Mm. We get some thread. I still have like my thread and all of those in my drawer. Okay, and then this is the machine. It's pink. It's the pretty pink that I love. And then instructions. And they give you like a piece of cloth to test on. But I'm excited for this because me as a skinny girl, not skinny, I'm not skinny. As a slim girl or shit, whoever, whatever, no matter your size, you do need clothes alter sometime, right? Yeah. Yeah, I wipe my money till I get from me. So I hope this can like do some of my stuff for battery. I'm gonna try it. Give me a second. After the big hype for how much we can sew, that literally did that stress me out, so I'm gonna just leave it alone. And we're moving on for now. So let's move on to accessories. And I'm going to just bring up my sheen order because I like to just match it and make sure that everything looks like what I ordered instead of going back. And you know, it just makes sense to use one stone kill two bird. So the first one is this bag. It's supposed to be like the Balenciaga dupe looking thing, but it's supposed to be like the Balenciaga shape. So I'm not sure. I wouldn't call this a dupe because it doesn't have like the sign or anything. I was expecting the shape to be, isn't the Balenciaga shape like a little bit deeper down here and it's a little bit crushed. I'm like, yes, this is how it should look, you know, like this. But I still think it's cute. It comes with the strap on the inside just in case you want to wear it long. A little loose. I'm gonna like this scent. I feel like I'll do something about it. People still put comfort ball in all them things to make it smell better. Another comfort ball did you so. It's always nice to have a gold purse. You need a silver purse. You need a dark purse. You need a white purse. Period. Bro, there's no negotiating no argument. You need those four color purse. So, this is the next purse. I already opened it. In my previous all that I threw away and I was saying that I thought it would be bigger like it is kind of small I was expecting this to like be a bag that I could bring every day like as a shopping bag but this is so small this is just like a going out thing for one like a Barbie doll I really love the material though it's really cute kind of different you know so I really like this it looks like the picture the only thing I was expecting was it to be bigger and the straps are cute like the this the material i think this will look so cute with that swimwear like probably a white swimwear and then a pink hat that matches a 
pink and white sneakers like that would be so cute like i look like a barbie oh my god so this is i'm happy about this it's cute so this bag the bag that i was most excited about and i think it's the most expensive not cheating though expensive but relatively the price is okay but yeah i was expecting this bag to be bigger and i was expecting it to shape like this instead of this like i'm gonna pop up the picture i don't know maybe i expect more from the bag here because i wanted to bring it to brunch but no i'm not sure if i want to bring it anymore but it's still cute so i stuff some stuff in it can i give it a better shape now i don't i don't know what i was expecting from it because it looks like the picture but i don't know Bro, let's just move on the back the bottom nicely made the next accessory that i bought are just some gold hoops because i think small hoops over like look at my hair i think my piercings are just so cute is it just two two i wanted three so just some gold hoops i'm going to wear them on sunday and i bought this bag in this pretty muddy brown color and i just think it's cute it's simple it's just like this everyday bag so this is it and the last accessory that i bought that is probably my favorite <laughs> So this is my second time buying sneakers from Shein. If you watched that video where I did my first Shein accessory haul, y'all know what I'm talking about. And it's still going good. I've worn it three times. Still cute. Never regretted buying it. So I like, let me take another leap of faith and buy another sneaker. Let me know what cheap and clean. Hello? Hello? Are you dumb? Are you crazy? these are cute these are in a size five you know so you know it's super cute super cute honestly if you don't like this bro this channel probably not for you we don't have no similar interests we don't share the same taste because these are freaking cute and what makes it cuter is the brown with the beige and then white like i really love wearing these three colors it gives this sleek clean look <sighs> i already tried it on it fits nicely i'm going to show y'all but not right now because it's just kind of weird for me to just pop up a foot in the camera no nah. bro they are cute even now just even if i just two wear me get those at the mirror i'm happy so i'm done with the accessory moving on to a little clothes that i bought i bought some casual wear because I want I really want to just change out my whole closet my casual wear closet my battery dying oh my god normally all I wear is like bag clothes or t-shirts going on the road and a part of my that girl journey I want to look the part even though that girl is not a look it's more of a feeling or a lifestyle or how you treat yourself with doing all of that you're caring for yourself and whatever in your own taste of clothing you want to feel a put together yeah t-shirts are fun they make me feel comfortable and so forth but i also want to be a little cuter a little more sleek a little more mature you know so i got some tops i don't even remember what i got with all this talking i'm pretty sure about t-shirts because i just love t-shirts i'm going to change my battery and then get back to that I'm not gonna change it, I'm gonna charge it. I haven't received my battery as yet. I should receive that on Sunday. Hey guys, so we are back. Um, while my camera was charging, I did went and get a little familiar with the machine. So can you believe that the easiest part is what I was doing wrong is the way I set the batteries. But I got it to work. I did all the stitching there. Quick intermission. I just want to say that I really appreciate all the comments in my latest vlog and all the, especially the DMs. Like y'all took the time out of your day to assist me in my natural ear journey, give me advice, and I really appreciate it. Like when never after do that, and I responded to around eighty percent of the comments and the DMs. I'm still responding because I really want to respond to at least 100% of the DMs because I know it's not easy to just up and DM someone especially if you're not like an extroverted person or if you know me already and I don't want to feel like um, I don't appreciate it or you're not heard or seen or 
you know me will say take courage to do that and me literally appreciate it like most of these advice i'm i'm yet to see one invalid advice or compliment or word of encouragement or anything like that like they're all good and i appreciate them all so i just want to say that and thank you so much i really love that y'all like that vlog because i love that vlog it's you know it's just not it's something that i have always wanted to do but i kind of find it hard to express it myself but the people on my private store will literally have to big them up because they let it known that it's okay to not be okay and it's okay to have feelings normally the only feelings i know to express are like anger happiness excitement and be miserable or you know i'm very appreciative like you know kindness but to like express anxiety to express hurt express feeling sad to express other feelings that people try to suppress or they try to conceal it's okay to do that it's okay to be vulnerable and being vulnerable is good not only for you but for others because let's be honest with each other misery love company people like to know that there are others going through the same thing that they're going through not saying that oh they want this person to continue going through that but they'd like advice on how did they surpass that how did they overcome it oh oh they are coping or oh, they are managing certain things but anyways let's see how this works so this is the thing it's just a simple one button push to start yeah yeah you see yeah okay period check the inside okay you know this is like it's i'm pulling it like i'm using all my strength i'm pulling it so it's up it's it's sturdy it is sturdy so yeah i recommend it i like it this is how the back is looking back of the stitch the front of the stitch so yeah I like this. I guess the people in the comment section are dumb because everyone is like, oh, it's hard to use. It's actually not. And y'all, if you want to see me in the comment section of cheating, please to like my comments. Me need points too. A girl needs to save on the bag. Hello? I don't have it. And now moving on to the clothing. I'm not try them on right now. Probably may go like try them on and add it right here or right here. You know? Maybe. Alright, so the first top, where's my phone? Every top is either a small or extra small. If extra small is available, I'm pretty sure I took the extra small. But if not, I had no choice than to take the small. Okay, so the first one is this turtleneck top. As I'm say, as I said earlier, on, sleek, elegant, but casual. It looks like it would fit a little bit big. So maybe I need to alter it. It's a size small. Your next up is this. It's a, it is an extra small. It's actually like the material that I was expecting from that one. I ooh, I love it. I love the green because green is like one of my calm colors. So I really love it and this is my favorite shade of pink. It's a bit big. It's not big but I wanted it to fit tighter so I have to like elastic band the back. The girls that get it, get it. The girls that don't, don't get it okay so this is the next top it can also be dressed up and also like be a top that you wear to dinner and so forth so this is it it's really cute i like the little detailing at the end and the little run shop thing at the side and then the top it has this lower i don't know what it's called but you know like it has three things going for it one two like it's a win-win it's so cute and it's a really pretty color this is a beige top i love the material i haven't tried it on so i don't know how it fits bottom kind of look like an unfinished pinanda you know them pinanda day like wait a pinanda they call it yeah and it's long sleeve you know in time i want something look more elegant I always just go for a long long oh i cannot talk I always go for a long sleeve you know and as i said maybe just have to get t-shirts it wouldn't be tash 
Uno me touch you know that you sure. This is uh, so basic, but I like it because of the color. It's just a nude t-shirt. Very simple. It's an extra small, but it actually fits like a small. So, I got another t-shirt. <laughs> and this one marks euphoria. Because you don't have the movie euphoria. So I like, mm, let me get it. And it has this pretty um, ombre color. Is it? Is this like ombre? like it's so pretty and you can't go wrong with a, with a t-shirt so i like this it's really pretty and let's be real right here let's be real you for ain't worth all the hype it's getting like I, when you for is going on and everyone talking about it i did not have, i don't have hbo i think it's hbo come on hbo max or something i don't have it and i wasn't going to pay for it just to watch one movie so then i remember back then before netflix and all of those we used to watch movies on illegal sites so I'm like, bingo. Oh, also Britney told me that I could watch it. Britney told me that you can watch it on this site. But I didn't watch it get it. I didn't watch it on that site. My sister downloaded it on off another site. And honestly, I just was not impressed. It's a good movie, no doubt, but it's not that good like how people acting. I got this romper. Very simple, casual thing. Probably like you know, country runner, so. I bought only one swimwear and I bought a one piece. I I mainly wear only one piece because I don't really love my love angles. So I mostly stick with one piece. Even though this one piece shows it, but when you wear one piece and your love angle show, it just don't look as how it would look in a two piece. But the colors on this, it's so pretty. Oh my god. And I love things that show my cleavage. Oh y'all know I love my booty. As out win win hello hello that's something i don't have it outside i'm gonna ask you and i bought two i bought two sleepwear wow this look really cool oh i liked how they um package it so it's not too crushed this is a size small yeah well here it is Ooh. and it has a little cute heart can I remind me of the Jada Wada logo? But hello, cute going to my bed period. And then this has this on it. This sleeper is so cute. And the white is just so clean and pretty. Like this look expensive and rich. It's so about one more. It's like a different style, I think. Yeah. This is the bottom. Bomba, this look little. And then this is just without the um the art and the bow and so forth. And it's the same thing. I don't think I was expecting this bright pink, but it's okay. Oh, I bought another sleepwear. And they all package them so nicely, like it's with the cardboard box. Oh, it's so cute. The material, they all, they all feel so comfortable to sleep in. And then this is the top. It's more like kind of crop-ish. But it's so pretty. They all just look so expensive. And they don't feel cheap. I like them. Oh my god, I've never been so excited to sleep before. Oh, I bought another top. But it's kind of see-through, so... I don't just wear this any and every day. But, you know, wear it with a black bra. Maybe some nice black jeans or, you know, giving a little different. Last but not least, I bought a... Don't you wait! I don't know why my bad laundry. I guess I'm gonna look sick with my girl. Period. So, this is the lingerie. <laughs> Maybe when I get a movie, you know? It's nice to have these in your drawer, you know? Is this stocking? Yeah. Ooh, we're getting sexy, sexy. The stocking and everything. Where's the whip? And that's it for this sheet in haul. If you liked it, let me know. Because me, I always have package coming in and I have no problem sharing it because I like to let people know what I buy. You know? Give me that way. Like, share it. Like, if you don't like it, you know, let me know. I can't give another link. I don't get keep. Like, it's all here for everyone. She in is an affordable site. Like, why not? Like, my memory card, even though it's full, like, have them on my memory card when we were going to country the other day and I just appreciate it so much because she gave me a memory card, Gypsy let me loan me her 
um, batteries and I'm just like oh, look at y'all helping me creating my content because I just got a camera and I didn't know that I'm gonna need more memory card and I'm gonna need more batteries and all of those and I really just appreciate it because they didn't have to you know morning morning bless the name of Jesus so I haven't slept <laughs> I was up talking to my friend Chanel for six hours and we were just up talking about all the woods we have took in our life and we just come to the conclusion that adulthood definitely the worst one. The worst would we ever take in our life. So now I'm getting ready to go on the road and I already pull out machine stuff. We eat some people, you know, like why people them say some shit but don't freaking gossip because they want themselves look big or something like their screenshots honey like don't play with me don't play with me don't do that anyways i'm going to add some sunscreen i'm going to use the neutrogena of sunscreen ah i miss him oh my lashes some Fenty lip gloss this is my favorite, and it done. But me say me can get something out of it. Yeah, done. So I'm gonna just use the clear one. Mm -hmm. Little, so make your mind drop. Don't be freaking depressed. It's only one bottle. Maybe I shed a tear or two. To be honest, thanks cry. Um, this is not paid promo, but I actually got this package free. So the scent of the day is from Designer Scents. Is a um, in, they also have a website, but I know them through Instagram. And why I really want to put y'all onto this? Not only that the product is really good, and I love all the scents because it's designer inspired, and it smells literally just like the same and oh i know it's because i i tried the jimmy choo i want you already air type and i also tried the um poison girl the your like the original one so yeah it's my literally just like it and it lasts so long but why i really want even though i got this package from <laughs> even though i got this package from february but what i realized is um the girl that own it she's a trying girl um nothing like a pity way but like she's her instagram page got her business page got deleted like two or three times and she just kept going and i really i really admire that and i see that she's trying and her products are good so why not talk about it put y'all on i have the creed imperial that's how it's pronounced i've never tried this like i've never tried the original one i have the the your savage him type I have the poison girl dior her type i've tried the original for it. this one and i have the jimmy choo i want you her type so what i really love about these fragrance like is the packaging what I love about these is that it's not that it's only oil because you know that oil lasts longer but it's the way it is formulated like it's in a spray bottle you can literally spray oh my god spray the oil on you know so just spray on my neck grab it in I smell so good oh my god I don't want to Rub all over me. I'm going to skin. And I'm going with um this bag from Shein. I'm literally just rolling out the Shein new stuff them right now. Literally. How is this sunglass? I don't feel so upside. On the foot, I'm wearing my pink bridget them look kind of black like the inside because i've had it over like four years no or yeah about four years morning guys so it's a another day 
Um, but before I talk to y'all, I just want to put these contacts in. I haven't worn contacts in so long. Let me make sure that all my lashes are out the way. So, I literally could not bring myself to pick up back the camera yesterday. Um, I did start recording some of me going shopping, but I don't even know if I'm going to still use that clip. So, I'm going to a brunch called the Mr. Brunch. And that's my first party in, well, since COVID. <laughs> First party party are right. my first party overall i can't recall going to any party at all and i'm well i was super excited was super super excited i went to yesterday to pick up my outfit because i know what i want to wear and i couldn't find it so me my supportive ass link my friend that so and i'd be like yo can you make this and the person said yes you know simple one too and to me as i said before i used to sew so you know like make me when something i gonna be difficult from when it's not going to be difficult and it wasn't difficult this is like um, a brown contact lens because i wanted something that looks just like a natural natural eye color yeah don't freak out trigger warning <laughs> Don't come out back. Okay. As you can see, barely. Ooh, not me crying. <laughs> Pretty hurt. <laughs> They are in. Just gonna moisturize with the fancy moisturizer. Ooh, my nose are a little bit runny for a while. So while I'm doing my makeup, I want to just no. First, I'm gonna finish the story. Not even story. Why I mess don't record yesterday? Oh, I messed up. I finished. I don't know what happened. The person said uh, that that them can do it, right? So I'm sorry. Then it look like one two, one two, one two, and I know the person can do them thing, you know. I took the measurements and everything and sent it. I took my measurement as the person requested, right? And I sent it, I sent them correctly because I'm educated and that's like me no offer to that. Measurements right, everything. Remember, you know, I sent the person the picture of exactly what I want. I sent them how I want the ways, how I want the material to look, everything. So I'm gonna go there. Number one. After the plan was to meet me with the stuff. All of a sudden, you're the different parish. You can't go meet me. You're gonna send your mother to meet me. All right, all right. Nah, you know? You know that serious and you, me need to see, me need to see my clothes. My clothes, me need to get. So straight to the point. Get the fit, try it on in a KFC bathroom. Nothing like when my ox, nothing. Pants tight. Listen, like, me literally have the look when I did want. I did not want the pants tight at all. I don't want nothing tight. I never want anything tight. I'm sure you two, two examples of what I wanted. None of them not tight. And I already talk and tell you I want this flowy, loungy look, you know? Let me explain thoroughly how I, how I want it. Because me want to make a look mega free. To make a get anxiety if I close off it, right? I'm going to sell it to you. And I sell it to the person. <laughs> Jesus! You want to see the pants wears? Like, men, uh, pants face look like bloomers. You know, bloomers when they used to be a basic school? Bloomers. So, the person who literally said, fuck what you sent, fuck what you explained. Make us do more and do. You see me? Basically, like, fuck you. Like, I was so disappointed on the phone. Literally. Yeah, like, I'm telling you how it look and that you did it wrong and you're telling me, like, me blind and my ass looking at the mirror and see exactly that. The something a bloomers and it's literally a short through the top. Like the material is thin, but it's not that thin. But it, it's yeah, it's not that thin. And even if it's a thick material, it's still be showing through it. So I'm like, yo, like, you definitely can't wear this. I already have a belly, you know. Why am I need an extra belly? I was hot as hell. Pause because I don't know how I'm telling this story and I'm not even telling it correct. So what really pissed me off. Other than the fact that I'm in this public bathroom back and forth with this person is the mere fact that the person wanted it to seem like it's my fault. Whatever I do not like is my fault because I took the measurement wrong. Tell me now. Or me if you take the measurement wrong, make the waist don't look all me send yet. Me literally screenshot because alright, I'll pop up the outfit that I wanted, right? 
you obviously cannot see the waist on it so i went out my way and i found a picture of exactly how i wanted the waist to look and i sent it to the person and be like yo this is how i want the waist right and the waist look nothing like it like the waist for the person make it look nothing like me ever seen in my life some kind of bloomers baggy baggy thing where literally i see through the clothes and you're gonna tell me some me not take the size right make the pants tight you said to measure my ties my ties are and make sure that it's supposed to be it's supposed to have space you as the designer supposed to know how much space you're supposed to leave because i sent you my measurement of my ties i sent you the correct measurement of my ties so that really pissed me off because first make it seems like it's my fault make it don't look how i wanted it to look when i explain completely like one thing mega do mega make sure Sometimes people like, mm, let me do my work or leave the person, let them do their work. No, if I go do my nails, I go tell you exactly how I want it. I don't care how professional you are, you're going to know exactly how I want it. Because me know what will please me. So that really pissed me off. The fact that I have back and forth with you, like me not looking at the mirror, you're going to tell me I see something completely different when I'm looking in the damn mirror. So that really did piss me off. And then you're going to make it seem like it's my, my fault, make it don't fit. And then I have to take a freaking taxi from the person place like spending extra money after me pay full and trust me if it was someone that i didn't know it would have got completely different because me one thing you're gonna do is give me a good service all right LG. well at the point you know at that time the top nobody have a problem with it when they find when when i realized i had a problem with it is when i'm at the party and every minute like it's supposed to drop like this but they have some loose thread, some only for ugly will lose something here, so where every minute people have to fix it. May I take a picture, the photographer take my picture, the photographer have to myself to fix it. People have to fix fix my tackle. And I pressed it. I pressed it as best as I can so it could have lay flat like this. The picture just came out well. But anyways, let's get back to the video. Ended up I have to fix it. I have to fix the top made how I wanted it, except for the sleeve. But otherwise the top made how I wanted it. But the top like this the sizing and everything but being that the bottoms are so tight being that the bottoms are so tight i'm gonna wear the top so i'm like yo the waist needs to be fixed and the top needs to be tighter so that it can actually match the bottom you know elan powder for actually got the place to get it altered if we had to call taxi like literally it's not upon road fandom taxi type shit because it's not in kingston where i could call a taxi it was in maven and my drive only brought me in the town and was going to come back for me because them can about them business. So at that point I didn't have a drive. So I'm like, me literally did just so pissed and me, me yet take a taxi because I'm afraid. The funny thing is that uh, as a friend, like, you know friends normally ask you discount and all of those stuff. Our influencers normally need free stuff which never, never is me. I've never asked for free stuff. You know, you give me a price, we need to pay the full price. At the point, it was worth it, but the, the, the outcome, the, what I got, was not worth it. Was not worth it. And I still pay the full price, and I'm just like, alright, it's whatever, yeah. Next time I know better. Then when me reach home and fit it over, realize that you only alter. Realize that they only alter the waist of the top, and the arms weren't altered. So I literally had to sew the arm myself, thank God for the machine that I bought from she in. Because it's late night, where the hell would I get that sew? Where? So, I had to sew it myself. And uh, literally, I just tried to make it work. Like, literally, I wasn't going to go anywhere. I'm like, shit. But then I have to cancel upon maybe you're this person and that the person there. And, you know? So, so, this is me now, trying to go in a better mood. Okay guys, so the makeup is done, the ear is ready, the outfit is almost finished, almost on. Y'all, this outfit literally just be stressing me out. Um, every second I can't even do what I want to go. But anyways, for today's scents, I'm using the Jimmy True I Want You mixed with the scandal. And when I say this combo is sickening, it's sickening. So what I do is I take the oil and spray it because everybody like a nice oily chest. I don't know 
I like a nice coily chest like look at that it looks so good so I put the oil all over like my neck my breast area and then I will layer it with the scandal and just do like just three squirts because you don't need more and that will have you smelling so good for the entire day even tomorrow you're just like Mmm, I want to smell so nice, you know? Yes. Anyway, so I'm finished getting dressed. Yeah, this top is stressing me out because look on the inside. Let me, let me show. Like this thing, like why the end look like this? And it keeps on showing like every time I put it in. Like, I have literally have fix it every second. Let's, let's so we out we out we out um never got a chance to show the fit but i will once i get there we're close by liam say hi, hi. channel say hi hi outside listen you can't realize it no? liam you realize i'm having one contact lens no realize that no. so, like no one's gonna realize it looks so natural I told you all. I told you all this. Not looking at you. You're not looking at my eyes. Stop telling lies. You know, like, every time I glimpse over there, you're looking at my eyes. No, I wasn't. Why are you lying? You keeping for the internet now? Yeah. Your lash them kind of hide it too. My lashes are so basic right now. It's kept here. You've been looking at my eyes. But okay, keep away. Take it. It's just not noticeable. Food, you didn't notice? And food loves steer me down like she in love with me. Me, me in love with you, Everybody in love with me now. Long time. I guess once you come in and me, come um, around me. No, stop! That will never happen. Nobody now coming at this girl. Mm -hmm. you can't take me out the fucking streets. Mm -hmm. Crazy. Anyways, once you come around me, I don't know if you know watch um good re new wait name. If you watch human resource. And I know the addiction um, monster. That's me. That's I. Okay. Better people addicted to you. Yeah, like once you come around me, then I just talk to you. You just get uh, my dose of addiction ness. Is there a party here? Oh, there's a fantastic Oh, wow. Oh, my God. Guys, I could take a bad picture. Of this. Them too close, though. Then they have one by What's themselves. Me? I mean, I like a party early. But I'm a party, yes. No, no, um. I'm seeing posts and say it's going until 8. So you see? I'm going to say back to normal and if it's 8 and then they get to. Normal, normal. No, the party was initially supposed to over at 5, but I think because of the rain, I say it's going until. Uh, as we say, that's what they always say. So you think they're going to get to the party? The party is full up, you know. Wow, Come already? Yeah, already parking. Come with me. Come with me. Miss Sam, you believe really safe full up already? No. Don't go. Well, look, tell me, say, I go. Is that a push? Where? She tells us a black push. Where people? Yeah. Watch them, watch them. Welcome to Jamaica. You must be a wee buck. I feel like it's supposed to park slant. You know slant? I guess. Don't tell me you get the ball a I'm a to a i a to i Party done, we are going to yard. 
Well, we got them here because, you know? Over there, um, Burger King, like, oh my God, this is one, or right, this is the reason, well, this is one of the main reasons why I'm happy that outside is open, so I can get food late at night. Like, I'd love that for me. I can't imagine I've been drinking or you're smoking or, you know, whatever your choice is. They both make you hungry. And can you imagine not getting fast food, going home to cook? Um, how was the party? How was it? It was... It was packer than expected. It was, it was a good party. Browning food up on the dashboard. <laughs> Look at my shoes. Dead in the shore. Dead. Dead. The place dirty up my shoes. I feel like I just made that face uncomfortable because too much fucking mud, man. Too much rain. I experienced like the day it just don't go as planned like with nothing at all. But it was still a good day. Yo! Jesus, let me put this. We can't put them up here, so tell me my little story. Alright, so I walked to the soup stand, right? And when I walked to the soup stand, there was a guy, two guys standing there. Two guys standing there, but I heard them asking for pasta and the man I tell them said the pasta done. So I'm like, I said to the man say, I said to the, the, the man that was sharing it, the chef or you know, server or whatever. I said to him, say, can I have a cup of soup? So he said, alright, he might come. So I walk like go to the back to get uh, to get uh, soup. And then this man right there beside me. Can you believe when this man utter out say mouth? It's like I that you do me, like when I when I hear when I say first first, he say something first first and uh, I feel like in there child and I'm like <laughs> you know like when I hear people people say does this uh, <laughs> smile or you know I kinda laugh. <laughs> Men if only do that but me do it. Like when I hear when I can't bother for you, especially strange I'm not talking to my face. So then he say, um I say I say I always go man, uno um man. So I'm like, huh? And he must say, Oh, look at me there, you're so stand up and I bet say, Are you the man I go serve first? Because you're a woman and you might go serve and me there so how long? So I'm like, is this man serious? And I'm like, yeah man, that would do no female man. That would do no woman feel like say, what the fuck? What happened to my brain? What happened to me exactly what the man said? To it, boy, me like, me literally in shock. Me stand up and me turn my back and I'm like, me cannot believe I'm really experienced this. In true color, very me, you know, me you know, I'm not saying a feminist, but very close to that. And I can't take this toxic men. I literally can't believe that I literally stay there and witness this misogynist man. This man, if you have bat him, not even know if a bat man, because bat man is a man, so I stop to that. But yo, you obviously eight man, so you don't even have to tell me say he's a misogynist. Mis you don't even have to tell me say he's a misogynist. Blood clap, I can't call the fucking word misogynist. I couldn't believe some literally experienced it, brother. I'm literally shocked. And then, but, oh, like your sneakers. Don't fucking talk to me. So, when the man come now and the man I share the suit, I said to him, say, Yo, um, you can please share it for this gentleman first. Like, yeah, right, ladies before a gentleman, bitch before, before, before a fucking gentle person. So, you go first. How people leave me alone? She may talk to me again. Anyways. So him like, no man, no man. Um do, you can do, do she first. She have she have her own first man as 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 always. And that's the end of the story. But I couldn't believe some really experience it or witness it in real real life. Me hear them pam podcast my, my, my fucking neck look darker than my body. Jesus, look like last of you some my little body. But don't mind that, it don't look so nice, like I promise you. I don't know why it looks alright, not for the light. But as I said, what's me cover the mic? I don't think so. I cannot believe, I literally witness it. I see the podcast them, and I my blood boil I'm all listening, and sometimes I still have to listen because I want to educate myself and just know how some man think. Like, trust me, I'm going to listen to them like Kevin Samuels. Me follow him on Instagram and I have to tune into him live. I'm not, I'm not, me no wanna, it's not like I agree with anything him say or me like him or anything. No, I want to hear how them man they think. I want to hear how they think. And it's so crazy, like, 
Can you believe that every man, Jesus kind of me going on a rant of woman. <laughs> but ladies, every man, like, them not have no choice. Them not have no choice. Them literally barns, so. They are all narcissists and manipulative. Okay? Some worse than some, of course. And I'm not saying, like, oh, men. You know, you have some really nice, lovely men. But they are natural manipulators. Like, if they want to manipulate them, don't even have to try. It come natural to them. You see me? But, you know, I could be all wrong. Maybe I'm just full of shit. Maybe I don't know what the fuck I'm talking about. <laughs> so, me like for listening to them, hear what all them think. Because, like it or not, men and women don't think the same. We don't have the same logics. Wow, Lane gone long doing it. I'm in here rant. But, me done now. So. Yes, oh, you know, so another day, another dollar. I have less than 20 minutes. Why am I not the phone? I have less than 30 minutes to get to the post office. So actually, I just want to show y'all how I package my ear for a giveaway and for resale. So, this is a wig that I'm going to resell. Don't mind how I mess up the freaking new mannequin head that I just bought. But because she can't do her edges and she can't install wig, I, you know, customize it and fix it perfectly, you know, make sure it's in order. And now I'm going to package it and send it off to the post office. So this is the air that's for the giveaway. Um, I did post it on my Instagram, so if you're not following me on there, you should. But next giveaway, I'll be only either announcing it at the end of the video or on my spam page. I won't announce it on my main page. Oh yeah, this is it. I flat ironed it, wash it. The lace is clean, looking brand new. And then I put this net over it so it can just stay in place. This is in the original package. This is not where the ears from. But I couldn't find that bag, so I'm just going to use this bag. And I'm giving her a bonnet for this and an edge brush. Let me see. So for the resale, this package, this is what it came with. It came with the lash, the bonnet, and the wig cap. So I'm giving her those. Not me having like 17 minutes to get to the post office. It's a 28-inch wig. I sold it for only $22,000. So I... Literally chopped the price in half when I'm reselling wigs for most part. I forgot to show you all the lace, like the lace properly washed. To the post office we go. Anyways, I'm closing out this vlog. I hope you enjoyed it. But before that, let's rewind this old motherfucking vlog and go back to next week. <laughs>
We're very hungry. I've been eating all day. Wait, well, not from yesterday. We're eating from yesterday. Eh? The shrimp is there? Guys, the food night. Oh my god. The meat just right off of the board. Sasha, you can't drive. Oh, the camera is already. 
Also ich setze auch. Was ist das? Guys, please ignore the person there right there, sir. We're back, but I just want to show you my outfit because I didn't. So this dress from Donet, you did it. This uh, body can, is it? Me never say Skims. Jesus, Skims cousin. Um, dress from Donet closet. These heels I bought today at Brick Brand, and this bag from an Instagram store. Me never write the name right there. So. Oh God! Why? Mercy, Jesus, Father. So that's it for today's video, guys. Make sure you like, comment, share, and subscribe. Love. Say bye. Bye, hoes. Kiss.